because hundreds of people know about it. It's a major operation. That major operation, or the long-threatened raids by U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement targeting immigrants for deportation, came and went over the July 13th weekend. And while the plan was to target over 2,000 immigrants who had been ordered deported, only 35 people were actually taken into custody. That's according to the acting director of ICE, Matthew Albens, who told reporters on a call Tuesday that the low rate of arrest was likely because the operation was highly publicized ahead of time. Every person in America has rights. As word spread about the possible ICE operation, immigration rights groups circulated Know Your Rights materials in immigrant communities. Local activists advised people not to answer the door to agents without a warrant. Even so, Trump claimed victory after the weekend's activity. Uh, many, many were taken out on Sunday. You just didn't know about it. It was a very successful day. Adding more fuel to the fire, the Trump administration said on Monday it would speed up deportations of supposed illegal immigrants by stripping away court oversight, enabling officials to remove people in days rather than months or years. But detractors question the accuracy of obtaining proof of residency. According to media reports, an 18-year-old U.S. citizen was recently detained in Texas over suspicion that the documents he presented were a fraud. Critics of the new measure fear that more U.S. citizens could be caught in the crossfire.